Hey guys, welcome back to the Moonshot Money Channel. Well, 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 look at Virgin Galactic today. Kathy Wood sold it, Richard Branson sold it, Chamath sold it, and then comes the test flight last Saturday. Whoa, now the stock is hot again. What are investors going to do? Was Richard Branson throwing shade? In this short video, we're going to take a look at what to expect now with Virgin Galactic. Earn more, save more, invest more, and give more. I'm Chase, and this is the Moonshot Money Channel. Are you ready? Let's go. If you want to know more about Virgin Galactic, the company, watch these videos right here. We've been studying up on Virgin Galactic for a while now. We also are going to give you our one year and two year price targets in this video. So stick around for those. This long awaited test flight was a huge success. Smooth as silk. Did you realize that it had actually been two years since Virgin Galactic had actually been to space? So it was about time to get back up there when you're a space tourism company. Check out this amazing clip from Saturday. Three. Two, one, release, release, release. Fire. Fire. Increase in pitch. Wow, look at that view. Michael Caldglazer, the CEO, made this great comment. Space travel is a bold and adventurous endeavor. I am incredibly proud of our talented team for making the dream of private space travel a reality. We were tweeting Saturday about the test flight, so if you haven't yet, make sure you follow us over on Twitter at MoonshotMoney1. We would also appreciate it if you gave us a like down below. It helps push the algorithm. Subscribe if you haven't yet and turn on that notification. Saturday's trip made astronaut CJ Sturkow the first person to have ever flown to space from three different states and it made New Mexico the third U.S. state to launch humans into outer space. The successful launch comes after a number of setbacks the company has experienced throughout its 17-year history. In 2014, Virgin Galactic Spaceship 2 exploded and crashed in California's Mojave Desert during a test flight, ultimately killing one of the two crew members and severely injuring the other. It was an incredibly sad day, the company's founder, Richard Branson, told CBS back in 2014. It can never happen again. That was seven years and much research and testing ago. Now things are looking much brighter for Virgin Galactic. Saturday's flight appears to have put its past troubles behind Virgin Galactic. Not only did the company make its first long-awaited flight from New Mexico's Spaceport America, it also carried research payloads for NASA's Flight Opportunities Program. The performance by both the spacecraft and aircraft were described as flawless. Needless to say, the stock price has been revved up a bit. From the 52-week high of 62.80, the stock had tumbled all the way back down to 15.50. That's definitely in the wrong direction. As of this filming, the price is over $25 a share now, a nice little run up from last week. Is the price positioned for a powerful liftoff? The twin effects of the new successful test flight and the robust demand for space flight tickets are putting some real zip into Virgin Galactic shares. This is not investing advice, but just for entertainment purposes only. Analysts are moving from neutral to buy. The Moonshot Money team is putting a price target of $40 per share by the end of this year. That's a massive 60% move in the next seven months, if we're correct. Our top of the world price target is $100 sometime in the next two years. Can Virgin Galactic get there? Absolutely. We're holding just under 1,800 shares. We have Virgin Galactic playlist in our channel if you want to learn more about this company and the opportunity in front of you as an investor. We're also excited about our next video that's coming out this week, so don't miss it. Make sure you turn on your notifications. Earn more, save more, invest more, and give more. And always remember, if you're not interested in your money, someone else is. Have a great day, everyone. We'll see you on the moon. Woo!